वेलकम टू द लेटेस्ट अपडेट प्रोग्राम द टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज प्रधानमंत्री मत्स्य किसान समृद्धि सह योजना रिसेंटली द सेंटर अप्रूव्ड द प्रधानमंत्री मत्स्य किसान समृद्धि सह योजना एडिशनली द कैबिनेट हैज एक्सटेंडेड द फिशरीज एंड एक्वाकल्चर इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर डेवलपमेंट फंड फॉर थ्री मोर ईयर्स अंटिल ट्वेंटी एंड ट्वेंटी The Cabinet Committee on Economic Affairs approved six projects of the Ministry of Railways with a cost of rupees twelve thousand three hundred forty-three crore, with hundred percent funding from the centre. Furthermore, the Union Cabinet has endorsed the signing of three bilateral MOUs by the International Financial Services Centres Authority with the Financial Services Commission Mauritius, the Capital Markets Authority State of Kuwait, and the Bangladesh Securities and Exchange Commission. Let us know more about the Yojana. It is a central government initiative under the Pradhan Mantri Matsya Sampada. It aims to structure the fisheries sector and assist fisheries micro and small enterprises. The scheme plans an expenditure exceeding rupees six thousand crore over the next four years, from the fiscal year twenty twenty three and twenty four to twenty twenty six and twenty seven. As part of the scheme, a national fisheries digital platform will be established to offer work based identities to forty lakh small and micro enterprises. Now is the time to test your knowledge. The question is, which fund has been extended for another three years up to 2025 and 26 within the already approved fund size? National Education Development Fund, National Health Protection Fund, Fisheries and Aquaculture Infrastructure Development Fund, or Renewable Energy Development Fund? Send the answer to this question in the comment section. Thanks for watching. For more informative content like share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications